Have you noticed recently that Amazon and Timu seem to be selling the exact same products? I mean, the models are exactly the same. Me too. I was super curious about this. So as an experiment, I decided to order a handful of items from both companies, Amazon and Timu, and do a comparison. So today's haul is gonna be a little bit different because not only am I going to try on things for you and show you what I got, I'm also gonna tell you how much it cost at both places, how long it took to get here, and then my final thoughts. My assumption going into this, and yours might be as well, that Timu is going to be less expensive while Amazon would be faster. But is that really what happened? Stick around to find out. So you ready? Let's go. Kicking things off, I was really drawn to this tank top because of the colored edging where you've got the seaming along the shoulders and the neckline that are different from each other. You've got the pink, the green, the white. I just thought it was really different and wanted to try and see how it looked. I really liked it on. The material felt very soft. It was pretty long. If you see how long it pulls down, like, could you wear this as a dress? I definitely feel like if you're pregnant, you could stretch this way over a nine month belly, like even twins. Like there's a lot of room for stretch in here. Maybe if you went to like a buffet and like your tummy exploded, like, like you're gonna fit, <laughs> it's still gonna fit. But I liked it, I thought it was a cute tank top, very soft and very user wearer friendly. I could probably get a lot of use out of this. This was one of the items that came from both quickly and it really shocked me to see that the packaging was exactly the same. The numbers on it are the same, the lettering on it is exactly the same. It's clearly from the same manufacturer. And for each of these, I'm going to go through what I paid for each of them and then how long it took to get here. For this blue tank top for Amazon, it took four days to get here and it was $19.88. For Timu, it took two days more, it took six days, but it costed a little less, it was $18.99. Okay, next up we have these overalls. They also came in the exact same packaging. You can see the numbers on them are the same, the lettering is the same, size small, they look exactly the same. It's the same pair of overalls. What I thought was really different about these is that they didn't have the hook in closures put on and they were instead just attached to the pocket in the back. I'm not sure if I'm keeping these, so I didn't want to detach them and start to assemble it. So I'm just holding them up. I am a pear shape, so this size small was very snug around my hips. Because of that, I didn't have a lot of movement. The denim is not very stretchy. If you've watched my Timu hauls before, the denim doesn't have a lot of give in it. I've discovered all the items from Timu. So that being said, it's a little snug. Length on these is pretty good. I'm 5'3", and they are just skimming the ground, so just about as long as I would want them to be. I think the image showed them rolled up. They might be a little too short for me if I rolled them up. I guess you could roll them up and it'd be more like an ankle length. They fit, I don't know, I'm a maybe on these. What do you think? Also, I'm not sure I love the color. It's kind of a weird grayish blue color. It's like not a traditional denim color. So I don't know, the jury's kind of out on these. Give me your opinions, what do you think? Okay, cost and turnaround time for both of these though, this is the shocker one. Remember my teaser about Amazon taking less time but being more expensive? This was the opposite for this pair of overalls. So in this case, Timu actually cost more but took less time to get here. So the Amazon version was $26.99 and took 10 days to arrive. And I do have Amazon Prime, so technically I should be getting Prime shipping on all these. The Timu price, $28.72, and it took four days to get here. That was a shocker. So in this case again, Amazon cost less, but took more time to get here. Okay, next item, I wanted to look at something that wasn't clothing. So this is the only non-clothing item, but I think it's worth evaluating. So you can see these are pretty identical. They're not exactly the same. They have different logos on them and they have different ribbing around the bendable area. You can see one is uh, just more rib than the other one. Other than that, these are 100% the same. The light power is the same, the capabilities are the same, the little USB charging port is exactly the same, the dimensions are exactly the same. I would call these identical. Well, they're not 100% identical, but 99% identical. If somebody was asking for this gift and you gave them the other one, they wouldn't know. But that being said, cost and turnaround time, Amazon's was $19.99 and took two days. Timu's was $8.48 and took 11 days. That's less than 50%.
What I've heard is that up until this point, we've had about a 10% overlap in items that both Timu and Amazon will be offering. But because of consumer spending changes and wanting to save money and be willing to wait, it seems like Amazon is going to be going directly to China manufacturers and brokering more deals to offer more Timu-like products. And in doing so, one YouTube video I watched, and I'll link it here, mentioned that up to 50% of their products will now be overlapped in the coming years. I think it's really interesting for us as consumers to evaluate what's going to meet our needs better. Okay, moving on, this green tank top, again, exactly the same product. The packaging was slightly different, but when I took them out and evaluated them, they are exactly the same item. It's a cute green tank top with rouging on the side, which just adds a little different flair to the fit, and I appreciate it. It just, it helps to cover a little bit of the side assets, if you know what I mean. I just feel a little bit better. It's not showing so much Green is my favorite color, so I tend to order and try on a lot of green items. And I think this one's pretty cute. It's pretty basic. And I think I could probably just wear it with jeans, with black pants, with khaki. You could probably wear it with a lot of different colors on the bottom. Okay, but the pricing discrepancy on this one, gonna blow your mind. Amazon's got here the next day and I paid $14.99 for it. Timu's took 11 days, so it took 10 more days, but the cost, $4.47. That's less than a third of the price. You save 66% by shopping at Timu. You have to wait. But on this item, kind of mind blowing. Next item is this cute purple dress. It has an elastic waistband. The exact same item came from Timu and from Amazon. I do like it. I don't have a lot of purple in my wardrobe and I wanted to try the color. I think the color is nice. I like the stripes. It's full length and so it's hitting the floor. Again, I'm 5'3" and it goes all the way down to the carpet, as you can see here. So I might trip on it a little bit if I don't wear a bit of a heel, but I wouldn't have to wear a super tall one. You know, I could do just a kitten heel or something that's an inch or two. No pockets, but that's okay. It did come with a matching ribbon belt and belt loops. Now I've seen a lot of influencers say you should cut those loops out and just wear a different belt because it cheapens it. So it's such a cute ribbon though. I feel like I could do something with it. Like, could I tie it up in my hair or do something? Um, I'll let Sierra, who's trying things on, try and find a way to use that ribbon. And meanwhile, I'll tell you how much I paid for it at each location. Okay, this is gonna be a surprise too, because the Amazon one actually took longer to get to me. It took 14 days to get to me, and it cost more. It was $25.99 from Amazon. The Timu one took 11 days and cost $17.77. On this particular item, Timu was both less expensive and took less time to get here. I do wonder with Amazon's importing from China and trying to figure out this whole model, are there some improvements that they'll making to gain back some of that Timu market share that they lost? Because it's kind of crazy that they're slower on a couple items. Okay, what am I doing with this ribbon? Did I figure this out yet? Am I still, <laughs> am I still playing with this? What's happening? Okay, well, I'm still playing with that ribbon. This might be a good time to say, if you're interested in this type of content, I would love for you to consider subscribing. I am turning 50 this year and I am trying all kinds of things. So I am new here on YouTube, just started last year. I love to travel. I love trying on different clothing. I love doing monthly challenges and would love for you to join this community and laugh with me as I try things. Okay, am I finally done doing that? I'm such a clown. I'm sorry you had to watch that. Okay, the last item that I ordered from both actually came and it's different. So I ordered two sets of tank tops, um, one in white and one in a color. And I looked at the photo on the model and I thought they were the same model, but when they arrived, they're slightly different in color and then the cut is different. So this one item I would say is not the exact same item. It's coming from two different places. The first one I tried on here is from Timu and the fit is just not great on it. So um, it fit me on the chest area, but then the shoulders were a little loose. It felt like they might even fall down or they were gonna be gappy. It just didn't feel right for my body shape. I do have narrower shoulders. So if you are broader in your shoulders, this might be a better fit for you than the other one I'll show you in a second. You can see that the colors are a little bit different. This one from Amazon, I felt like fit me a lot better. And so it's just tighter in the shoulders and I felt like I it wasn't gonna fall down and actually filled it out the way I was supposed to. So if I keep either of these, it's probably gonna be the Amazon one. I'm not sure I'm gonna keep either because it's a little low for what I'm comfortable with. I don't always go out there so 
open to possibilities. That being said, I did pick up some low cut bras from Timu, which if you haven't seen that video, I'll link it here. I also got from each of them a colored top of the same cut and make. Amazon and Timu were offering different colors. And so I was able to get a green one from Timu and a blue one from Amazon. Color wise, I really like them both. Green and blue are two of my go-to colors. I just feel really good when I wear them and I wear them both a lot. Fit wise, the green one, I felt like I wasn't filling it out again, as I mentioned the same with the white one that I had. While the blue one from Amazon, I felt like it was a much better fit for my body shape. Okay, given these weren't 100% apples to apples, I would say these were like 90% similar, but they weren't exactly cut the same. Material, I felt like it was the exact same material, but they are different shirts from different manufacturers. Okay, but let's look at cost and delivery time. For the two shirts from Amazon, I got them next day and it cost $29.98 for two. For the two shirts from Timu, it only took three days and the cost was $22.83. Quality wise, I would actually equate these quality wise I just feel like the Timu was using a pattern that didn't suit my body shape and so because of that I might be willing to pay a little bit more at Amazon for one that is gonna work for my body so those are all the items I'm now gonna give you the total cost for each and how long it took on average for each item to arrive the Amazon grand total for all these items was $137.82 I also pay for Prime, that's $139 a year or $14.99 a month. So keep that in the back of your mind too. The Timu total, Timu total, Timu total, Timu total. The Timu total for all those items was $101.26. Most of the items I got for Timu included free shipping, but I did have to pay $8.97 for some of the items to be shipped. If you take the shipping and the prime purchasing out of it and just look at the cost of goods, Timu is about 30% cheaper. For the Prime membership for Amazon, obviously there are other benefits that come along with it, such as Prime Video and being able to see the channel. And you can place multiple orders each month. I'm not ordering from Timu on a daily basis, whereas I might have 20 orders to Amazon in a month. And let's look at how long it took on average for the items to come. Amazon surprisingly averaged five days for all these items to get here. When you add up how long they all took, divided by the total number of items, the average was five. The average turnaround for Timu, seven days. One last thing that I'll share is return policy. As you know, Amazon accepts returns. Timu accepts returns as well, but you get one free return shipment per order. So if you decided to return something after you had returned the bulk of the items from your order, you'd have to pay for that additional return. Timu's return policy is 90 days. Amazon's return policy, 30 days. Now you're not gonna be able to find everything that you can on Amazon on Timu, but let's look at the breakdown. 30% less, about a two day more wait time to get your items, and pretty generous returns. I'll let you draw your own conclusions here, but on these items that they both offer, something's kind of obvious to me on where to get them. Again, I would love if you would consider subscribing, and if you wanna see more of my shopping hauls, check out this playlist, and I'll see you in the next video.